Hello everyone, welcome to Wattrain.com. Uh, Wattrain.com is a bulk WhatsApp, cloud based bulk WhatsApp application and API service provider. Uh, in this video, we are going to explain you how you can download a free WordPress plugin for all the existing and upcoming customers and integrate this with your WordPress site so that when someone is purchasing product or services from your website, they get notified through WhatsApp immediately and they will also be updated uh, as far as the status of their order is concerned. Okay, so wattrain.com is the website. I'll just quickly log in and show it to you where can we get some basic information in order for you to get this integrated with your Word, uh, WooCommerce site. Okay, so I logged on to the website. Uh, there is a button called WooCommerce plugin. You just have to click on that and it gets downloaded. It's a small file. It will not take much time to get this downloaded. Now the prerequisites are ready. Now you have to log in to your WordPress dashboard by using your site.com slash WP slash admin. Okay, so uh, this is kind of a home page or dashboard for your WordPress plugin. So we just have to go to plugins click on add new click on upload plugin select choose files and wherever you have downloaded the file you can select the path and just click on open and click on install now so this plugin will get installed on your wordpress website and just click on activate okay so the installation and activation is done if you scroll down you will be able to see the what trend plugin here okay in the left side menu there will be a icon of what trend you just have to click on what trend so here we need to do some settings Okay, I'll quickly explain you what kind of setting can be done here and how it is useful, useful not only for you but your customers also. Okay, so first of all, we need to specify the default country code which is 91 because we live in India, so we have specified 91. If you keep it blank, irrespective of the kind of number your customer put in, based on the country code, it will start sending out the messages. Okay, so these are the order statuses okay when someone purchases something from your website then this would be a new order so you can type what kind of a message you would like to send to the customer okay so thank you for your order on our website we will process the same as soon as possible this is entirely up to you the kind of message you want to would like to send it to the customer okay so i'll just quickly save this and explain few more things okay so if you click on help you will get some more information about the keywords okay so along with the message if you would like to uh, send them the order id or a transaction date or order summary or product list whatever you want you can choose the keywords from here okay so just to show you i'll just simply click the first name of the customer i'll simply copy this and i'll paste it here after thank you i'll just paste it here okay so I'm not going to define a message for each and every order stage, okay? But technically you can do that. You can send them a message when the order is on hold. You can send them a message when you are processing the order or you can send them a thank you message when the order is completed, okay? So based on the kind of uh, sale process what WooCommerce give you based on the version you can define the messages okay so let's test this i have filled up some information a test message for the new order and i'm just clicking on 
save changes okay so before going ahead you need to do some more settings here so on the right hand side you will see the token access token and the instance id you need to fill up this in order to uh, application to work okay so where you will find this information you just have to go to the dashboard of whatrain.com click on whatsapp i already scanned one number here okay so when you click on profile you will get the api details you will get the instance id and the access token so let's copy this instance id and paste it here and let's do the same for access token it was the same but still i am showing it to you how it is to be changed i have saved changes okay so you can click on help and test this integration so scroll down you can write the number here 73850851189 and test message form okay so the successful i have received one message here test form what rate okay so the configuration and the integration is complete okay now we will test this in the woocommerce site okay so we have set up everything each and every thing is in place so i will open the website in a incognito mode and let's make one purchase okay so i'll go to women's category and select random product i have one product which has zero value so i'll just select that so i don't have to use my card details here so i'll click on add to cart view cart check out so your customer either he will create a new account or he will log into the existing one okay so let's create a new account I'll simply write I'll put my number here. This is the number. I'll put the email address here. click on place order okay so once the order is placed i have received one message thank you sandhi for your order on our website we will process the same as soon as possible okay there is plenty of settings in the application you can uh, go to the wordpress plugin and explore uh, whatever functionality we have so you can set up a follow up message if customer is not is customer is coming on your website and not buying the product uh, send him the reminder message you can set up the timeline for the message to go 24 hours 48 hours 2 hours similarly if the follow up uh, follow up is completed with the order you can send them a thank you message so there are a lot of stuff you can do there are third party integration also which you can do okay so these are the codes which you can use while designing the message for your customer you can uh, specify the shipping details here you can specify the order details here you can specify the billing details here so all the elements contents you are tracking in the woocommerce application you can specify while uh, creating a message to your customer okay so the, this is all i i hope you guys understood the concept of woocommerce application uh, you can download the application from the dashboard and try it on your woocommerce site so thank you guys i'll see you in the next video bye